Hi, everyone. I'm Xiang Yu Chen from University of Kansas. I'm so happy to have the chance to share our work with you. The title of our paper is Accumulated Trivial Attention Matters for Vision Transformers on Small Data Sets. Let's first take a look at the multi head self attention in Vision Transformer. This figure is from the first Vision Transformer VIT. You can see it consists of a transformer encoder and the transformer encoder contains multiple transformer blocks. In each transformer block, it has a multi-head self-attention module, which is a key to uh, capture long-term dependencies between tokens. To get the weighted values after attention, we first calculate the attention probabilities A, then we use the attention probability to enhance our value vectors. Take a closer look at how we get final weighted values with attention probabilities. This is a visualization of the last formula. To get the first row of SA, we multiply the first row of uh, attention probability A0 with the uh, entire values V. Here is zero. Each value represents the similarity between first row inquiry and all other tokens in value. From the figure, we can see few values are larger and most values are smaller. This seems uh, meaningful in terms of similarity. However, it is problematic when we observe all these attention probabilities as a whole. Also in this example, we first sort all attention probabilities and then we set a threshold 0 0.05 to separate uh, ways and, uh, from uh, trivial ones and non-trivial ones. We can see that we get up to 62 trivial attention weights and only three important uh, ones. And the sum of trivial attention consists of up to 0 0.69 of the final uh, weighted uh, values. This means that accumulated trivial weights are dominating the attention. And this is harmful when input contains much noise. So our motivation is to suppress trivial attention weights on vision transformers to make them converge faster on small data sets. To achieve this, we propose a method called SETA, which has two steps. Step one is to set a threshold coefficient t to divide weights. Step two is to suppress our trivial weights to a portion as of uh, the maximum attention. To achieve step two, we propose a transformation named twist, and this is a formula of twist. And we can prove that the sum of the x prime will always be larger than the x max. To, to make the sum of a, a portion of the maximum, we just simply multiply each side with a scale s, and we make the s learnable, and the learning rate is different from the model. These are the results. We can see the increase on both uh, CIFAR 100 and the tiny image net. We visualize the learned suppressing scale for different layers in VIT. Interestingly, we find that our values for first three layers are smaller than one for both CIFAR 100 and tiny image net, while values for deeper layers are larger. We think this is because for VIT, the first several layers contain much more noise, and we need to suppress those noise. Okay, that's all from my presentation. Thank you for your listening.